In this problem, we know we have 173 acre stand. We know we're trying to get 436 trees per acre planted. So maybe it's a 10 by 10 foot spacing. And we want to know how many seedlings be shorter from the nursery. And so uh, when we look at this problem, pretty straightforward, 436 trees will go on one acre. And we have 173 acres on our one stand. I cancel out units there. And that means that I am going to need to order 75,000. 428 trees for this one stamp. So at this point, you might think you're done, but there are two more steps that we need to take um, in order to implement this in the real world. The first is our call percentage. Remember, in silviculture this semester, we're going to use 10%. So basically, we're saying that from the nursery, we think that we need to order 10% more seedlings than we actually want to plant. So we can throw out defective trees, trees that are too small, or have other issues with them. Remember that that 10% is just for class this semester. In the real world, you may find that number is different. If you're working with a good nursery and you're buying lava like pine species, we're very good at producing in nurseries, your number may be well less than 10%. If you're working with hardwoods, that just can be difficult to get high quality hardwoods out of nurseries, just they don't have the genetics, they don't have the tree improvement behind them. There's a lot more species with hardwoods. You may need 20%, you may need a larger number there. So that 10% is a number you're gonna come at, that's the heart of silviculture. You'll figure that out in your career. But for class this semester, we're gonna use 10% every time. And the simplest way to increase the number of seedlings by 10% is what I've written out here. You simply multiply that number by 1.10. That, that gives you the proportion that scales up by 110%. So that means we order 82,970.8 seedlings. Okay, you see an obvious problem here. Um, eight tenths of a seedling isn't going to do you much good. That's overly precise uh, for what we actually need here. So here's the second step you do to get the correct number. This is a large number of seedlings, you know, over 80,000 seedlings. When you work with bulk orders like this, it's pretty typical to uh, order seedlings by the thousand. And so our final step to get the correct answer, we will always round up. Even if this was 82,001, we would go ahead and round up just to you know, build a few more cold seedlings in there. So we want to order seedlings by the thousand. Thousands for large orders. Um, so we round up. And that means we round 82,000 up, we need to order 83,000 seedlings from the nursery for this particular step. So there you go. That's how you decide how many seedlings to order to plant a stand.